Give me damage this time. Yeah, I missed it like two times, but that said, it didn't drop very many times. Uh, this is basement one. Screw it. God, dude. I can't do this. Stars. Blank room. Alright. Yeah, my damage is good. My fire rate is not bad. Instead, I'll fight the mini boss as well. Oh, yeah, I probably get to go to both. Uh, let's see, more valuable. Nice. Yeah, fanny pack start happened. That'll be interesting. dude was the MVP last game. Like, for sure. By the way, that rock stuff, like, does not damage you after, like, the first frame it comes out. You can walk straight onto it. And I have numerous times. I don't know. I haven't picked him up in a long time. Probably because of that. But it'll be there for the rest of the run if I do. No, Bumbo's not part of Super Bum. <laughs> Again. Uh, can you use this item? Anyway, yeah, people will talk about it for the whole run if I hit Bumbo. I kind of hope that Afterbirth Plus doesn't tell you when you're using any uh, modifications. Specifically so I can, like, remove Bumbo, but not tell anyone. Uh, but only on the stream save. I don't really care on the YouTube save. Hey, that's actually really useful. But no, it should tell you if you're, like, there should be an icon or something if mods are used. Absolutely. No, bad pills are still a neutral. Yeah, just code out the no achievement icon. Easy. Easy money, man. Easy money. I don't like Bumbo because chat doesn't shut up about Bumbo. Bombs are good. You know what? I'll keep the remote detonator. Take that. Oh yeah, and Bumbo killed my family. Can't forget about that. That part's less important though. Mm. 
Nah, Abel's still a meme. Bumble will never stop being a meme. Take a little while, but it'll get done. Never mind, we can do this. It's much easier. Bumbo's a fine item. Nothing wrong with it. Though they did nerf it, so it's less good. I'm sure there will be a binding of Bumbo mod within like 20 minutes. Every sprite will be Bumbo. I'm sure it's probably easy to just swap sprites. I mean, I don't mind stuff dropping bombs on me that much. There have been a couple occasions where I intentionally took the uh, number two item in order to spawn those bombs, like, intentionally. Really? All right. That was planned. Challenger now. Yeah, it's a, it a pretty great library. Okay, that works. Someone shoot, shoot at him. Come on. I believe. Buddy. There you go. A little late. Oh dear. Oops. Wow, got a black heart. Fanny pack is conspiring. Everything's conspiring right now to give me health. I'm down. Yeah, you know, even though I had the game and I played uh, the original, like, when it had just come out, I don't remember the two-heart nail, the two-soul heart nail, because I was probably too bad to ever get it. I, like, don't know that I ever earned a double room for a while. I was, like, real, real bad. It was impressive how bad I was. Guess I will also bomb for this because there's a dime. <sighs> oh man, you don't even want to know how bad I was at the original Binding of Isaac when I first started playing it. I actually talk about it all the time, or I have talked about it frequently. I, like, Monstro was the hardest boss. I could not kill Monstro at all, ever. I died so many times on Basement One Man. Freaking Monstro being OP. Larry Jr., I had a chance, but I also died a lot, you know? Larry Jr. is tough. Larry Jr. is still tough sometimes when he wants to be.
I wish something shot tears at me. Dry baby would have this. Priestess, sure. I was probably worse than you were when you started. When I started, I was, I was exceedingly bad, and I find it hard to believe that anyone could ever be worse than I was when I first played the Binding of Isaac. That was worth. But it's okay. Dude, when the Widow was first added in the original, it was so hard. Like, the Widow was such a tough boss. They nerfed it, like, significantly as well. Uh, also, like, I think it did a full heart. If it doesn't now. Something, like, I don't know. They nerfed something about it that was, like, a huge significant thing. But, like, Widow was a really, really tough boss. Everyone had problems with the Widow when it first came out. Does Widow do a half heart now? If so, then yes, it definitely did a full heart then. Did have more health too. I think it might have been faster actually. I think that was a big piece of it. I think it moved faster. Like the jumps were faster or something like that. I don't know, the widow was ridiculous. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the jumps were faster actually. I don't know, someone should look up like the first Wrath of the Lamb videos from like anyone that was making Isaac content then. I started like well after Wrath of the Lamb, so everything had been like fixed and whatnot. But people that were playing the original for YouTube and stuff should watch their first play of uh, Wrath of the Lamb and see just how insane the Widow might have been. Did they really nerf Fistula? I didn't think so. But I'll have to test it if I find Fistula this run, which it's like impossible not to. Yeah, but Ragman's two attacks suck, and Haunt's two attacks are like, whatever. Haunt's two attacks at least provide interesting and different dodging. Ragman is just like, don't be near Ragman, shoot at stuff that isn't Ragman. Yes, actually, Dex Spring. Uh, one patch, you could kill yourself on a blood donation machine, except instead of dying, you would be invincible. Uh, that was that was pretty good. And that was a good bug. They fixed that one relatively quickly. <laughs> Congrats on a thousand one percent. Nice job. I 
I don't know if you can still despawn Isaac's heart. I got Curse of the Blind. No, not that. Anything but that. Oh boy, this sucks. That was the strat. Have um, one of the things die inside of uh, Dry Baby so that it got all four tiers and was likely to um, kill everything. Gonna do that again in this room. Where that works too. Hey, 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 hey. Fine, never mind. Dude, I miss flying in and out of challenge rooms. Understandably fixed because it was broken as heck, but like, I miss that. Yeah, screw Eternal God, dude. Screw Eternal God. It's gonna take a while. Ah, oh, you would spin. That would be very nice. Calm down, Krampus. Calm down. Oh, I hate that. Enemies move when they have shot a brimstone beam recently, and the brimstone beam still has a hitbox out. That shouldn't happen. Like, I dodged the beam successfully. The enemy moving. Should not change that once the attack is already over. Yeah, challengers were good, man. Challengers were good. Boss challenge rooms, like always a boss item. It made sense. It made sense. Like you can get an extra boss item, and you have to fight two bosses, possibly from the same floor. Like, yeah, okay. I was not paying attention. I was trying to read chat. Someone said something I wanted to read. It's the point of the game. Have fun. Play the video game. Same as any other game. Really? I, I was sure I'd kill it. It's the only reason I didn't dodge. Because I was like, yeah, it'll die. No problem. Oh, yeah. 100% chance uh, Devil Room had items. Good old days. Well, except Krampus. The boss pool is indeed better now, by a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Sorry, that was intentional. Never hitting this boss. The skeleton key in the secret room makes sense. Like, it does. What sucks is that secret rooms are so, so unlikely to have items now. Like, dang, man. Bring back secret room items. Seriously. Uh, let me see my items. Yeah, Krampus was a Christmas update one year. They're a little more likely to have items. But like secret rooms previously had items all the time. It was just unlikely they were good ones and it was unlikely that you were gonna reroll into the good ones. So it worked. But man was the D6 OP. Oh man, the D6. It's uh, whew. What an item.
Yeah, one up is mad rare now. Dude, my name's never been a secret. D6 was a three room charge in the original. It was great. It was stupid, but it was great. Dude, brim snapping was cool. Missed that as well. They did make, to be fair, they made brimstone better than brim snapping 90% of the time in this game. So while it takes less effort, it uh, at least they didn't like make it bad that you couldn't do it. Because getting the brim snap with five hits was very hard, to say the least. Yeah, Habit gave you half of a charge for your use item no matter what. Always three ticks. It's cool. It's really overpowered, but it's cool. That was worth it. Screw these guys. Yeah, okay. I'll just take that. I would have re-rolled it. But it was Pyromaniac. This is Depths 1. Okay. Ah, oh, technology getting huge when you had a ton of damage was so cool. It was so fun. Having lasers as big as the room was just sick. Uh, I won that last run. It took a while, but I did win. I don't know when you left, but I got Incubus. Uh, I was down to one heart for a while. I had to nearly full clear the entire uh, cathedral. And I got some good items on the chest and uh, had a little bit of health, and it was, it was all right. Still had two hearts left when I killed Blue Baby. Brains is really just keep trying. Brains is a tough challenge. But like, there's not a strat for it. Besides wait for your brains to respawn before entering a new room. And just play really patiently. Other than that, just keep trying until you get it. Dude, Mom's Knife Wiggle Worm was so good. I love that that was a thing, and I'm so sad it's not now. Oh, I'm tanking this guy. Screw him. Uh, cause screw Headless Baby. I don't want to get uh, the transformation, really. And it's a useless item, essentially. Because I'll tell you two things I can't afford right now. 0.3 damage down and 0.3 tears down. Oh yeah, the bug with like candle and the knife, that was fantastic as well. It was fun. And it, like, didn't keep doing damage. It hit each enemy, like, once, and then became useless, so it was just fun. And it was really, really funny with homing. Oh my god, it was so funny with homing. Alright, 
I'm gonna need you to shoot the dry baby. Candle is the ultimate cheese for everything. That's the thing. Okay, is this a joke? Buddy. Buddy, thank you. Like, Candle let you kill any enemy, even if it had left the screen. There was a spot on the screen where even when War was doing the uh, bomb attack, you could still hit War. As one example, you could uh, shoot at walls while Death was doing its charge back and forth and stuff. Um, or like while the horse was doing it. Uh, like you could hit any enemy at all times. Conjoined's not, like, that bad. It'd just be that bad this run. Conjoined is, like... I mean, it's useless, but it's cool at least. No, I didn't make YouTube content until Wrath of the Lamb had been out for a long time and they were done patching it. Two of spades. I mean, they're... Six, well, technically there are like 800 videos of me playing Wrath of the Lamb on YouTube. You can see me play the original if you really want to. Oh, again, okay. It's, uh, it's been quite a long time. I'd be quite rusty. And I don't think I'd enjoy it. I think that it's gonna be something where I'm gonna enjoy the nostalgia. Rather than the game itself. Well, you hadn't said again when I was saying that. I didn't use that key, don't lie to me. You can get item rooms in the shop in the same way in this game. Uh, this is step two, of course. <laughs> that guy dropped a black heart, what a guy. No, I'm just I'm let that happen. I'm gonna do that again. So virus has pretty good consistent consistency at actually spawning the black hearts because it's like stupid to run into enemies on purpose pretty much. But in the right situations, it's pretty useful. How many times do I get the air room in what situation? I don't get them often because I don't ever do the things that might get it for me. Oops. Screw it. No, virus is understandable. Because it's bad if you don't get anything from it. Serpent's Kiss is like... Like, stupidly overpowered though. So that one, yeah. No, no excuse. Oh, it's gonna take a while, by the way. I would assume that Charm Shot is more likely to fire with better luck, yeah. But I don't know how much luck it takes. 
Yeah, virus is a chance for an enemy to drop a black heart if it dies while poisoned. Possibly after, but I'm not sure. Dude, the original virus was so good. I missed that. I would also probably prefer the uh, 30 damage on contact, because that's a lot. Thank you. I might have base damage. Technically, I do have Lump of Coal, though. So I have more damage on whatever metric it's giving me damage. He's <laughs> still got the black heart, man. It's so good. Uh. Yeah, no, the virus wasn't that OP. It really wasn't. It was a really good item. But you weren't gonna win the item on the par or win the run on the parasite or the virus. Sorry, I'm just not I don't words help. Easy every time with the black hearts though. I love it. Uh yeah, this is my spawn tier rate. Absolutely. And this would be my spawn damage if not for having Lump of Coal, I think. I don't know, I'm just taking this one. I need to teleport. Oh yeah, Old Parasite was really good. And it was a skill shot item, which I really liked about it. If you could aim, you could do extra damage by a lot. It wasn't easy to do that aiming. Wow, no one wanted to die for that. Like you definitely earned that damage output. Nah. My tinted rock. I need to stop uh, taking all this damage on purpose. Because you know it's not worth it. Alright, whatever. Is there another tinted rock? Be good. Like, no. Parasite um, did full damage, and if you shot an enemy at the edge of its hitbox, the split tier would still hit this, like, the enemy that you just shot. And thus be super good, doubling your damage. Um... Now you can't hit the same enemy with one of the split shots without like having like tiny planet or something like that. Uh, and they do a quarter damage. But they split multiple times now. Parasite originally only split once. But like the tears were full damage at half of the remaining range of your shot, which I think they still might have. But they were full damage with half of your remaining range on that shot. And then the ability to hit the same enemy twice because of it. And in certain situations, depending on the enemy, you could hit with both split tiers, which was pretty sweet. Yeah, there was no way to hit the same enemy multiple times with the same tier in the original. So it's cool that Rubber Cement allows that. I like that there is an item that lets that happen. 
Even if there's only one, that's okay with me. Yeah, you definitely have to have piercing for it to be worth having shielded tears. Of course, I wouldn't have taken shielded tears if I hadn't had Curse of the Blindness run on that floor. Nice. Save me. It's a little bit. Yeah, I liked that Rubber Cement overrode piercing. Because now it means I can't take, like, sides or anything if I have Rubber Cement already. Because Rubber Cement is 100% more worth it than having piercing work. Um, like, even for 1.5 damage up. The extra hits are just better. So I can't take, um... I can't take, like, Death's Touch for the sides. Huge hitbox, extra damage. I can't take, uh... Like Cupid's Arrow or Sagittarius for the Dorito tiers. Just because they look cool. I, uh, it's It sucks. It's a sad life out there. Yeah, you can still hit extra times when having piercing if you have rubber cement, but it's just not as good. Like you said. I really thought it was about to hit me at some point. Oh, this room's gonna suck. Dude, Deadeye is such a cool item. Like, I love the aesthetic. It looks so good. It sucks that so many combinations with it make it so that you're just going to lose your damage bonus all the time. At the same time, it's nice not having it all the time in some situations because you just like shoot out the sun and go blind. But uh, th that's cool while, like, while you've got it for a couple minutes. <laughs> Still, it's a uh, cool item. Dude, nice. I don't remember if uh, Rubber Cement Overrides Continuum. I would guess yes as well. Because if it didn't, Rubber Cement would just become nothing at that point. Screw it. Nice, I got the skip. Give me, give me, nope, no black heart. This is gonna take a while. Alright. We have but one way to get this kill done. There's only one way. Uh, give me the... No, I need the line that's just aimed directly at me. Three black hearts. Do it. You won't. You won't. In fact... That's not even close to me, friend. Uh. Nah, I don't use any mods. So I haven't played any of the modded uh, versions of the game either. 
Oh my god. This run needs to kill me. I, I mean, I'm not going to be able to beat Isaac. That I can... Well, I guess I am. It's just going to take a while. Milk is cool. Like, nothing wrong with the item. It's just also unlikely to be particularly useful. If the Devil Room appeared behind the items, that would be like the fifth time I missed it behind the items. But I didn't hear the sound. And I didn't see it and I looked for it. But like, I look for it every time and I've still managed to miss it like three times at least. But I was pretty sure it didn't spawn that time. Help me. Thank you. Dude, collar is so good. <laughs> Always revive when I don't need it. Oh, you think this run hurts to watch? Just you wait. It's only going to get better. Okay, cool, so they don't still have to be poisoned for the black heart drop. Good to know. Nothing shoots tears in this fight. This is going to be the worst. Immune to explosions. Ugh. Oops. Nice fifty dollars from marshmallows. Wow. It says finally awake in time to watch the stream. I watch your YouTube every day. Thanks for the hours upon hours of entertainment. I need you to say something for me. Good day. Uh, with the Aussie accent required. I don't think I can do it, but that was the best I can do. I don't have, like, I don't have that accent as a thing that I do. Some accents I kind of can do. Thank you so much for the super generous donation, though. But, like, I can't speak Australian at all. Get an orbital. Oh, yeah, okay, I'll just get an orbital real quick. Don't worry about it. Some accents I kind of do, like, all right. I did give it a try. It was just a bad try. I straight up did. I just can't do that accent. I can speak Canadian. I can speak Canadian quite well. <laughs> yeah, just had mate at the end. I told you my attempt sucked. That doesn't mean that it wasn't the best I can do. I am really good at Canadian. <laughs> yeah. That's just Australian's not a thing I do. I don't have British either. I used to have British a little bit. But now I don't. <laughs> yeah, I know monsters can take years. Good thing I've got years right now. I <laughs> I actually have quite good boots when I attempt to do a serious boot rather than a, an exaggerated boot. $27 for Maltese or Falcon. It's just the, uh, the little happy face. It's real cute. Thank you for the generous donation as well. 
crazy. Thank you so much. Both of you. The best part is when Canadians don't think they have the Canadian accent and they like really really do it. Rex knows he does it though, to be fair. So he you know he he's allowed to have it. I used to be better at accents than I am now, but that's because now I don't do accents for any reason. Uh, I remember this one um, Australian kid that was a transfer student to my middle school. <laughs> we asked him to do an American accent, and he did Texas. Everyone does Texas, man. <laughs> Like, that's not what Americans sound like. Yes, it totally is. That's exactly what they think of. Like, that's what people think of when they think of American accents like in Texas. I can't even do the Texan accent. I don't even remember what it sounds like. <laughs> this is my base fire rate, I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go use the other card, I guess. No, I legit don't remember what Texas accents sound like. A card against humanity. It's gonna take a while. Yeah, America is pretty huge. So, there are a lot of different accents. And of course, everyone speaks unaccented English. That's just how it works. But I mean, where you where you're from? You do speak unaccented English. Oh, thank you. I need this. But well-spoken people can speak well with an accent. Of course, if you go through any sort of, like, vocal training, I guess, for speech, you probably work on having as neutral of an accent as possible. But I wouldn't know that. I haven't done that. This is just, you know, it's how I, people talk where I'm from. How did I drop it? Whatever, I don't care. Yeah, I mean, to me, I'm unaccented, but obviously anywhere I go where people have a regional accent, they'll just be like... that. They'll know that I'm not from there. They'll be like, oh man, what's with your accent, dude? Now whatever, I give up. Ugh, this is how we're fighting this boss. Yeah, there are a lot of areas that have a really neutral accent. So, the only way you could, um, you could, like, with neutral accents, you can't really place the people except with that one test that was going around for a while where it asked you your word choices for a bunch of specific things. Uh, it placed me pretty close. It was pretty ac or accurate to my location. <sighs> 
I don't remember the test actually. Like I don't know where it was. I really brought you pretty far from where you are, huh? Some of the terms for some of the stuff I like had never heard or seen before. But I don't remember them because it's been so long since I did it. No, I, I don't remember it. I don't know anything about it. I just remember it was going around for a while. But like, that's the kind of thing people don't really know the local dialects of places so accurately that they can just like be like, oh, that you're from there. That's not a thing. But with the power of the internet and people collecting lots of data, they can do that just fine. So it's really possible to place people like that. Cherno is a pretty, he has a pretty neutral accent. And I think that his Canadianism is very minor. Why am I killing Isaac like this? Because my tears, I have um, lost contact. I can't shoot him. Sadly, the run just did not want me to have any happiness. <sighs> see, look at this. Alright, since he's shooting a little less. But see, when I shoot, then Dry Baby doesn't get hit. So it's faster to not shoot, most likely. At least when the tier density picks up a little bit. Yeah, no, that's the problem. If I shoot, I'm gonna get less damage overall because I'm getting less tears into Dry Baby, which does far more damage than I'm likely to. At 40 per hit with a decent chance of doing it. This one I'm not going to be able to really do anything about. This phase is going to be tough, time consuming. Ugh. Shooting definitely not really faster. But it's attack dependent. Depending on what attacks Isaac was doing, it was worth it to sneak in like three shots. Ugh. Three percent of your life? Dang. Short life, man. Short life. Thank you. No, why did you run away? Means I'm not gonna get to contact damage you. Oh god, I moved too far. I'm fine. Ugh. Good luck on blue baby. I won't need it. Cause I'm gonna get really good items out of the first room of the chest. I hope. I need to not hit those tears, man. Sorry, man. I have to murder you now. Dude, Ipecac would be awful right now. Oh, help me. That's not it. You didn't help me. Why would you do this to me? I mean, even if I got Curse of the Blind, that's fine. I would not 
I would take everything. Regardless. 269 from Hasp that says, learning case you on the keyboard is real awkward. I'm at around 10 to 12 difficulty now. I wish I could spend 500 Canadian dollars on a controller. There's gonna be a Sound Voltex at Anime North. I'm so hyped for that. Dude, Sound Voltex is the best. That's why I'm going to MAGFest next month. Sound Voltex. All right, whatever, man. I'm just gonna let you do that. I'm pretty much gonna take like every opportunity to go play Sound Voltex that I can. It's so good. And very different from Keishu. Wow. All right, this is gonna be a marathon. All right, I don't wanna be where I am, but oh, god dang it. No, this is actually okay. Okay, I need you over here. That's good enough. But congrats on already getting to 12. It's pretty impressive. Even for a keyboard. That's okay. It's not a problem. Being addicted to sound Voltex is good. That's my own fault. It's the same error I made last uh, double adversary. Last run. This one's just a little worse. You can't bomb the door, dude. It's uh, the chest. You can't bomb out of rooms. I'm stuck here. It's not up to me, man. And being gender neutral, by the way. I say man and dude and works for everybody. tried so hard, got so far. No, seriously, this run needs to die. If it weren't for the double adversary, I might have had a chance, but like, I don't know, man. Right now, I'd say probably not. Chest and dark room. I uh, know you couldn't bomb through doors in the chest in Wrath of the Lamb. You also couldn't get curses on the chest. Much better feature. There you go. Alright, no, I'll do it. Nope. me that much. It didn't hurt me though. Yeah, no, that helped me a decent amount. My life is improved. My quality of life is higher than it's been in a while. Yes, you could bomb into secret rooms while fighting. But you can't do that in this game anymore. Oh no. Yep. It's okay though, because I get a second chance. Just what I always wanted. Oh. Excuse me, sir. Thank you. And then after this room, I'll have a black heart. God, if I actually have to kill Blue Baby with these... Oh, I have two black hearts. If I have to kill Blue Baby with these stats, I'm just gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry, but... I will cry. Don't think I won't. <sighs> I 
I don't know. It might be better not to pry still. Especially now that I have uh, the fly. Oh, that was doable actually. But not easily. It might not have been doable. The gap might have been too tight. What's the worst that could happen? A 30 second wait's the worst that could happen. Oh my god. Haps donated one dollar. Said typo intentional. Would you drive to Ontario over three days of sound voltex? I'm asking real questions now. How devoted are you? No, I wouldn't. I don't have a passport and I don't particularly want to get one. I don't want to go through the process. Thank you for the donation. Okay, we're good. Uh, I've never had to do this room with a bad build. I... I don't know anymore. I don't think I want to live on this planet anymore. No, stop, Ragman. Stop. <laughs> I'm very cornered. No, stop. Stop what you're doing. Oh, man, that's my own fault. Every time. Oh, hey, I got the Lost Revive. But I don't have the Holy Mantle. So, yay. Oops. Come on, just kill me now. Thank you. Thank you. Also, I got killed by a little spider, I guess. But I like the way that picture looks, because it looks like it's a little stick dude with, like, a circle and, like, arms and legs instead of a spider.